A fall like this could break an elderly person's hip. But this belt-mounted airbag, called the Volk, could spare them the pain and expense of a fracture. Bones weaken with age. Falls leading to injuries are a major health problem among the elderly worldwide. Dutch entrepreneur Filippo von Hellenberg Hubar came up with the idea of a protective belt. Our target group falls on average two to three times a year. Um, so the Volk is actually a reusable product. Uh, when a fall is detected, the system activates um, and the ga gas capsule releases the gas into the airbag component. Um, after this has happened, you can fold the airbag component back in, uh, insert a new inflator, and the whole system is good to go again. Sensors and a computer built into the belt tell the airbag when to deploy, but they also have to know when not to deploy. Biomechanical engineer Heike Valerie helped develop the Vogue. It's quite challenging to detect a fall, but it's just as challenging to avoid misdetections of falls when people are just making movements that seem like falls. So for example, when elderly people sit down, they tend to often just slump into the chair. And that kind of movement could easily be confounded with a fall. The developers have been working with actors, imitating the gait of the elderly. But the belt is about to go into testing at nursing homes. The Volk is expected to cost around $480, which von Hellenberg Hubar says is a fraction of the cost of a hip fracture. It could be a big help if the testing shows it works, says James Goodwin, chief scientist at the nonprofit Age UK, a charity that works with older people. I think the impact of it could be very, very high, uh, with a lot of benefits to older people and to health systems. Globally, we're talking about many thousands of falls every day with huge costs to um, healthcare costs the world over. Not to mention the pain and suffering, he adds. Depending on how testing goes, the Volk may be on the market within a year. Steve Barragona, VOA News.